This is an RTV6 update working for you. I'm Lauren Casey and these are your latest headlines from the RTV6 newsroom. We now know the identity of the man who was shot and killed outside of a Greenwood apartment complex overnight. Police responded to the Honey Creek apartments near State Road 135 and Curry Road around 2 o'clock this morning. 19 year old Orion Daquan Mitchell was found dead of a gunshot wound on the sidewalk outside of one of those apartment units. Police tell us that Mitchell lived inside the apartment with a family members. Now investigators say they believe Mitchell was targeted by the shooter, but so far they don't have any information on a possible suspect. If you believe you can help them, call the Greenwood police at the number on your screen. That's 317-865-0300. Now to hiring Hoosiers, an RTV6 initiative connecting you to jobs, training, and other employment resources. It's a restaurant known for their waffles, coffee, even their all-star breakfast. But when you think about starting a career or changing a career, Waffle House may not come to mind. Well, the company is currently looking to hire hourly employees to cook and serve food, but they're also looking for managers to develop and move up in the company. There are 17 different Waffle House locations right here in central Indiana. Managers receive extensive training four days at Waffle House University. University in Georgia. After that, they learn the basics of running a business. Waffle House is looking for employer employees rather who love interacting with people, have a hard drive to work hard, and eventually have goals to move up within the company. If you're interested, you can head to hiringhoosiers.com. Time now for a check of our Friday forecast. Todd and Lauren, as we work our way throughout the remainder of the day, skies will be mostly cloudy. If you have plans on this Friday evening, temperatures hold pretty steady in the mid to upper 20s, so it's not super cold out there, but it's not uh, as warm as it was yesterday. And then as we go forward in this forecast, Saturday. Saturday is the better day of the weekend. We'll start off in the 20s, warm into the mid to upper 30s, but we'll have sunshine and light wind. So it'll be a pretty pleasant day for us considering it's the middle of February and it's the better day because on Sunday the morning hours will be dry, but as we head into the afternoon and evening hours, light snow to the north, wintry mix down to the south. If you do see the snow on Sunday, we're looking at generally less than an inch of accumulation, although some communities to the north could pick up a little bit more than that. Todd, thank you. For more stories and weather you need to know, you can download the RTV6 mobile app. Thanks for joining us.